We're going to take blood pressure measurements while Isaac is exercising. Mm -hmm. The key is that we monitor his uh, blood pressure and heart rate while he's exercising. Okay. And then the machine is taking uh, electrocardiogram. And uh, we're going to monitor constantly what uh, while the vital signs are on, on Isaac. Uh, the rationale for the Portland Bridges to Baccalaureate is that the National Institute of Health have identified a shortage of minorities as scientists, as researchers in public health and biomedical research. And one way to increase the pathways of minority students to pursue careers in biomedical research is for them to have an experience with established investigators. We have selected Portland Community College to work with Portland State University so uh, the students can work with different mentors in a variety of settings. The idea is that these students, once they graduate, they will become better investigators because they will have a better understanding of the reasons why especially minority populations are uh, disproportionately impacted by uh, disease and therefore uh, health disparities. And you monitor the uh, mercury bubble until it reaches its maximum inflammation point and then you release about uh, two to three millimeters of mercury per second. My research involves the effect of exercise on prostate cancer. We know that prostate cancer is greater among African Americans and it's also among certain uh, Hispanic groups. So by working in the Portland Bridges to Baccalaureate, I can work with students who understand uh, some of the lifestyles that are uh, related to cancer in minority populations. And then I can also then engage the students in understanding how exercise might or might not protect against certain cancers that are disproportionately uh, affecting minority communities. We've actually have formed a, a student group called the Student Association of Biomedical and Behavioral Sciences. And um, this group meets um, bi-monthly. And um, we talk about um, different areas in health and behavioral science. Making sure that they know that, that everything that we do affects our body and affects mm -hmm. our systems. And, and going to the doctor once a year just to have our blood pressure checked isn't going to so isn't going to cut it. It has to be a daily when change. When you know you've been eating Big Macs all year, you haven't exercised and you've been over consuming drinking or you know right. that your body's not going to be healthy from that. You should know that. Mm -hmm. I um, joined the Bridges program so I can have the opportunity to work in the health field and have an internship this summer so I can so there can be multi-diversity in this field, especially in the research field. Um, I'm very interested in helping people and community health and I'm very interested in actually making um, our population, our citizens, better and stronger and smarter and healthier. In Ghana, there's a lot of uh, uh, lack of medi uh, medical business and uh, research in medicine in general. So what makes this program interesting to me is to learn more about research and uh, how to help people. What we have is a model of the heart right here. And what you'll see are these, if you turn the heart this way, what it looks like is the heart is surrounded by a crown of thorns, right? That's where the word coronary arteries comes from, and those are the arteries which bring blood to the heart. The Bridges program consists of regular Bridges seminars that are scheduled throughout the district, ideally one on each campus per quarter, and those seminars are specifically designed to bring researchers onto campus to expose the students to researchers who are working in that field um, but it's also an opportunity for the students to engage with those researchers um, on a personal basis. They get an opportunity to talk to them about their personal background. How did they get from here to there? What were some of the stumbling blocks? So it's, it's more than just attending for the information at the seminar. They're there also to develop a relationship with the researchers and to gain an understanding of what it takes to move through the process. It's a great program. I've um, met very, very interesting and um, great people. If I didn't have the Bridges program at PCC right now, I probably would be in a different field of interest. 